Hey guys, what's up? So, um, last week I showed you how to make this octagonal frisbee boomerang, and here's how it flies. See? Just like that. And you can find the tutorial in the upper right hand corner. Well, now I'm going to show you a full this variation that I just designed. This is the bow tie version of it, and this one also flies like a boomerang. Hopefully I'll fly it right this time. Oh, yeah, see? Actually, you know what? I'm going to, um, I'm going to show you from the... This is the one that I made from printing paper cut square. This one's easier to fly than that one, okay? So hopefully it'll boom right back. See? Just like that. So I'm gonna show you how to fold it now. Alright, wanna learn how to fold it? Ready, set, here goes. Alright, so for this model I used a six inch square of, of origami paper that's red on one side and yellow on the other. Alright, and that's what I'm gonna use in this tutorial. And for this model I recommend using printer paper cut square because it's it, it's bigger and it's easier to fly. So yeah, so if you use printer paper cut square, this is what it looks like when you do that. And uh, yeah, all right. So, um, but uh, but just for this tutorial, I'm gonna use this square sheet of paper. So um, for a yellow flicker with a red bow tie, let's begin red side up or bow tie side up, and let's fold in half. This model is pretty much just like my um, octagonal frisbee ring, the the original one right here, which I taught right here, and it's just a bow tie in the middle, that's all. You could probably figure this out on your own without watching the video, but just in case, I'm going to show you how to fold it. So, fold in half, and fold in half this way. And now we're going to fold the corners to the middle, so we're going to blend like this. Okay, so now we're going to do is we're going to fold the two opposite points back out. So we're going to fold this point to right here. So where this crease hits the edge. Like this. And repeat on this side. So fold this point to here. And now unfold those two flaps and we're going to fold them inside like this. So right on the existing crease. And flatten. And repeat here. Just like that. Okay, so now we're gonna um, do the this middle part of the bow tie. So um, to do this, we're gonna fold this up right here. I'm gonna lower my camera real quick. Okay, so we're gonna fold this flap up. How much? Well, I think it, it's probably to taste. It's to taste, but I say fold it up probably about a finger's width, like this, and make sure that um, this point right here aligns with the crease. So yeah, about a finger's width is good and unfold and let's tuck it inside like this right on the crease and repeat on this side so I'm gonna fold this up about a finger's width like this and unfold and tuck it behind like this on the crease just like that okay so now um, we're gonna take this point we're gonna make the the, the corners the octagon now so we're going to fold this point to the middle, but we're just going to make a pinch mark right in the middle right here. Crease mark. And take this edge and fold it to the crease mark. And make sure that the fold, make sure you anchor the fold at this point right here, so this crease. And make sure that the edge aligns with the pinch mark. And make a nice strong fold. And fold this edge to the pinch mark. And same thing, anchor it at the crease right here. And like that. Okay, now unfold, and now we're gonna rabbit ear it, so make those two folds at the same time. And make sure it comes to a nice point right here. And now flatten that point up, like this. And fold it down. And now um, fold it back to the left like this, and we're gonna take this point and fold it to this point right here. Like that. Now unfold, and now unfold here. And th and this is just just this is the exact same thing, like in this model right here. So 
um, we're gonna do is um, we're gonna take this crease right here, this this straight crease, not the slanted one, but the straight one under it. So we're gonna make that crease a mountain, like that. And we're gonna refold this down right on that little diagonal crease right there. See, so just make it like this and just fold it down like that. And now we're gonna look inside here and see this point right here. We're gonna fold that all the way to the bottom, so to this point, but inside. So just fold it down like that on the existing crease. It's already a crease, and crease everything sharp, just like that. And we're gonna do the same thing on the remaining three points. And I'm gonna fast forward this part. All right. So if you don't remember, then you can just re you can rewind the video. So all right, here goes. Okay, now just crease everything sharply, make it as flat as possible. And remember, if you want it to be really flat, you can stick it under something heavy. Like this. Like a stack of books or something, whatever. Something heavy. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to crease everything sharply. Or you can just press it onto the table like this. And make it flat like that. Alright, just like that. And we are ready to fly it. Let's see how it flies. Okay, so to fly this thing, just like um, the the other one, you just hold it like this, see, and you just you just throw it like a frisbee, just like this. So here we go. I'm gonna do it like this. Hopefully it'll come back. Let's see. You just you, you have to throw it like just right. If you throw it right, it'll come back. Eh, yeah, not bad. Oop. <laughs> like that. There you go, that was a good one, just like that. So now, the one from printer paper. This one's easier to fly, because you know it's bigger, and it's a little bit heavier, so yeah. Oh yeah, just like that. Oh and yeah, one tip um, when you're throwing it, you know, it's not really gonna come back if it, if it goes like up like this, like vertical like that. You have to like, th like you have to make sure, like when it's spinning, you have to make sure it's upright like this. So here you go, let's try it again. See? Just like that. You want to make it like that. Ooh, that was a good one. <laughs> like that. Oh, that, 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 that was sweet right there. <laughs> This one's much easier to fly than um, this one is. <laughs> yeah. See? Just like that. Eh, yeah, not that good. I'm gonna do it that way again. Ooh. Eh, it didn't, it, it kind of went like that. Remember, like this. Hmm. Alright. <laughs> just like that. <laughs> Alright, so there you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed folding this and hope you enjoyed flying it. And comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Alright, bye bye.